Candidate for U.S. Senate Shelley Berkeley made Elko a campaign stop Monday, visiting with fellow Democrats and other interested parties as she promoted jobs and industry while promising to level fair taxes on the middle class if she's elected this fall. I've been a strong supporter of mining and supported legislation in 2012, just recently, to ensure that we would be able to expedite mining uh, permits and make it easier by easing the unnecessarily burdensome regulations on mining so that the permits can be issued a little bit easier and the work can commence. So that's number one. Number two, the mining law of 1872, as you know, it often comes up for consideration or renewal or uh, repeal and I'm very cognizant when we are discussing the mining law of 1872 that nothing is done that would compromise or hurt the state of Nevada. So there's a number of issues that I've been working on. As uh, you probably know, um, Brian Sandoval and I have been very cordial friends for a number of years and I admire and respect him, but he supported the Small Business Jobs Act, um, thought it was good for Nevada and said so. I voted for the Small Business Jobs Act, which would have helped uh, many small businesses here in the state of Nevada uh, get the tools they need to not only stay uh, in business, but to expand, hire employees, uh, which is very, very important. As you know, small businesses are the very backbone of our economy. My opponent, Dean Heller, voted against it. So here the Republican governor supports my position and, and my stand in voting for the Small Business Jobs Act. My opponent, Republican Dean Heller, voted against it, threw the small businesses in the state of Nevada under the bus. The race between Shelley Berkeley and Republican Dean Heller is among the most watched and closely contested in the country right now.